How do y'all Mortal X lives? I think it's time to play a little Minecraft. Alright, so I have been out to the desert today. And I have gathered up hopefully enough sandstone to do part of this floor anyways. Um, I want to I wanna change it up a little bit from what I've got at the moment. Um, all of it's going to change because uh, I know that some of this is getting replaced depending on, like over here, I've got some doors and I don't want the red blocks in front of the doors. Come on. And so I've got to change that up. But, uh, yeah, I, uh, I spent about... I don't know, 10 minutes, 20 minutes digging in the sand. Um, actually recorded an earlier episode. And uh, I've actually recorded a couple of times a day. Didn't like it, so I trashed it. Uh, there, was, there was a bit of a traffic jam in the nether that was getting me irritated. And, uh, so I kind of probably spent, I don't know, a few minutes ranting about <laughs> pigmen. Uh, why are they always staying on the track? I don't get it. But, uh, I, I thought it'd be better if I come back, uh, do it again, since we've got the floor started here. And, uh, I want to I wanna try maybe to do some... Uh, what in the world did I just do there? I grabbed the 30 pieces of sandstone I had. Knowing that I don't... Oh, that's just sand. You're not even... You're not even sandstone yet there. You tricked me. Okay, that... That will... That should be plenty. Uh, and so... Um... Yeah, you know... Uh, the first time I started record today, I actually got a phone call in the middle of it. So I had to stop. Take that. But, uh... Once I get this part here filled in... Um, and like I said, I'm going to change up the edges here a little bit. And, uh... And then I'm going to... I want to bring in some brown clay. And I want to maybe... Do some... I don't know, some kind of something with the brown clay in the middle of this. I I wanted to not necessarily replicate, but kind of fit in with the pattern, or not the pattern, but the colors that I already have, only I wanted to brighten them up a little bit. And then uh, I decided I don't really ever use sandstone in my building Ever. Like, I don't think I've got sandstone in any of the buildings in this place. And I don't know why. Uh, and sandstone comes in a few different designs. Well, I guess I didn't have sandstone because it's sandstone. And it doesn't really fit the idea I have of my town. But, as an expensive imported floor, uh, I think it looks pretty good. Uh, but I am going to put some some other designs in this. Um, I think not too big of a design, but I might do... Uh, I'm kind of getting an idea in my head right now what I want to do. I think it should look nice. It will also help me determine where I want to put my doors, for that matter, so... Uh, now the the doors here are different than the doors at the front of the place. That is going to change up the pattern just a little bit. So it's not going to be um, symmetrical. It's going to have to be... Well, I mean... Right. It's not going to be symmetrical. It is going to be different on one end than the other because of the placement of the double doors on either end. Which would be fine. I don't have a problem with that. Uh, Alright. 
Some more sandstone here, and a little bit more here. Nice. And that gets us our nice floor, much better than what I had. Uh, I did, I didn't like the cobblestone. All right, so you two have got to come out, and you two have to come out, and then this will actually go in at least this far. Nice cream colored floor we got going here. Uh the same is true on this end too. This needs to come out. So you can fill this in a little bit here. Alright. Now where's my brown stained clay? Beautiful. Is it getting nighttime out here? What's going on? I was thinking it's nighttime. It's, it's never nighttime. Uh, so I was thinking was if we take if we take this here and we'll just do like a little path from either side of the door here. And then Let's say we put, okay, what kind of doors are we going to have on the side here? Like, this is going to be, this is going to be a double door right about here, I'd guess. Alright, and so then we would do an opposite double door from here. Which means that this has to come out, and... I probably should have put my sandstone down while I was back there. This comes out. Alright. And then we get some more sandstone in here. That's not sandstone. Sandstone, sandstone. Sandstone, sandstone. And then this comes out. And then I fall in a hole. Okay, and then let's go ahead and get our little bit of sandstone in there. Ooh, let's grab these redstone blocks. They were difficult to acquire. <laughs> I uh, I probably dug out another 30, 30 blocks, I think, uh, down in my quarry looking for redstone. Um, and... Uh, and then I took a trip in the nether over to one of the other places, and I grabbed the redstone out there, too. And uh, and then I got back to find out I needed, like, 15 blocks to finish off, and I had 43 blocks already here. Okay. Now we'll take this out across through here. Then, we'll do that, and that, and this will actually go all the way back to the stairs, which I know doesn't line up with the other side, but that's fine. Okay. I'm going to need to make some more brown stained clay here, I think. Yeah, I'm definitely going to need some more stained clay for this. farther than I was intending, but that's alright. Okay. 
and then we'll get this down through here. I'm going to have to figure out exactly what I want to do. Oh, and I'm out. Okay, now it's nighttime for sure. Okay, now. Oak wood, brown stained clay, oak wood, nether brick, yeah. Got some hardened clay. That's not really what I need, though. Although I can turn the hardened clay into brown stained clay pretty easily. I don't have I don't have a full stack though of hardened clay. Um, okay, now Let's see what we can come up with here. Do this a little bit here. That's too much. I don't like that. Hey, Skelly Bob. Pick up some loose blocks while we're down here. Always with the loose blocks. Oh, I see you, Glitch Pig. And then... Okay, so I... I don't like that. I'm gonna just have this go like this. Okay. And then... This... What did I do? This can't do that because we're against the wall. Or I have to change my pattern. One of the two. Um, we take this out here and we move this up to here. Let me get this to fit a little more symmetrically. <laughs> I'm going to need this clay for sure. I don't know if it's raining or blowing ice out there or something. It's cold. I'm going to have to look at turning the heat bag on or something here. I uh, I don't leave the heat running in the basement here. It's usually plenty warm, but uh, uh, right now I don't produce enough body heat to uh, keep this place heated up and so because um, usually the upstairs is producing a lot of a lot of heat down here because there's in the floor heating and so when that's going off because it's cold upstairs then we uh, uh We get plenty of heat down here, but right now we don't have any heat. So, uh, because it's not cold enough upstairs to need heat today, but down here it is. And I'm out of, I'm out of pieces, so I've got to go. Oop, this is the wrong way. I gotta go make some more clay. Do I have brown? Is the question though. Do I have potatoes? Because that's a good question, too. I'm running low on potatoes. Uh, speaking of cold, so we're sitting at uh, family dinner today, and we're all sitting at the table. It starts getting really windy out, 
and uh, <laughs> all of a sudden the door blew open. Um, our uh, our one door needs to be replaced, and uh, it's um, through combination of the screen door getting broken, which is the backstop to the door. Uh, and uh, some issues with one of the gutters and the door frame being warped I think at this point uh, it does not close easily and so uh, last fall we started having issues with it I might not have I might not have cocoa beans um I might have to go into the jungles of um, man. I was hoping we wouldn't have to take a trip, but I don't have cocoa beans here, and I've got to have cocoa beans. I don't know why I'm unloading all this, but let's just go ahead and unload it. I do know where a jungle-ish is, uh, but we're going to have to take a trip out and about to find it. Alright, it's exploration time. Come on, go down the ladder. I suppose I could have ran from here, but uh, I do know generally where a... Jungle is, I think. Uh, but yeah, so we gotta get a new door. Um, and then <laughs> after that blew open, they were talking about getting the door. They're like, "Oh, you're on vacation this week. You can go look for a door." I'm like, "No, not gonna happen." They uh, they won't like anything I pick out, so there is no way I'm going to get a door. Uh, all right, so from here. Oh, wait, you know what? I forgot that my place got overwritten by jungle. Maybe. Maybe I've got it right here. Um, There is a jungle... Off that way? I need to get back out here and fix that roof and stuff. You guys got any cocoa beans? I'm in need of cocoa beans. Do, uh... I need some jungle wood, too. Oh. Maybe I can get it just jumping. Is that new? Or am I hallucinating? Like, I didn't think you used to be able to jump and chop... Oh, right, there's some cocoa beans. Jump and chop things down because they would reset. And... It seems to me that I can jump and chop things. I mean, I know it's probably because my axe is so fast, but... I tried this on another version of Minecraft, which uses an older version of... or a modded version of Minecraft that uses an older version than the 1.8 that we're on. 1.83, I think I'm on. And uh, I couldn't do the jump chop thing, so I think that's new. But yeah, I gotta get back out here and fix this roof uh, where I accidentally opened the wrong version of Minecraft and my map. Get my house put back together here. Because there's like a huge chunk missing in the corner. <laughs> I thought this turned out pretty good. Oh, and the stairs are missing too. Which is ridiculous. I like my house. All the carpet disappeared, though. And the uh, stairs disappeared. And... Like, I don't understand how the dark oak stayed. And dark oak slab stayed, but dark oak stairs didn't stay. And the new weird doors stayed, but... Carpet disappeared? Like, it just... It seemed really bizarre what disappeared and what didn't. I guess I should just be glad that the whole house didn't get overwritten. Uh, it did, however, overwrite my chest. 
So for the third time at this place, I lost all my my chests, and I think I stole all the sand out of there. Uh, <laughs> we lucked out with the cocoa beans. We didn't have to go very far. Um, but yeah, they were they were discussing today all the remodeling things they want to do. Uh, and by they want to do, I mean they want me to do. Because they don't actually really do the remodeling. Uh, they do paint. Because I refuse to paint. And, let's see, look at... Took out part of my road... That's not a creeper hole. That's a... We remapped the chunk. And, uh... So they were... They were going over a list of things they want to change about the kitchen. Because, you know, we lived in the house for four years. Uh, so obviously... Obviously four years is long enough for the house to look the way it does. Uh, they already, they they repainted the hallway. Uh, they wanted me to do that, and I refused, so they painted the hallway. And then they painted the bathroom, and then they wanted to trim up in the hallway, which I don't like, and it keeps coming off the wall because of the type they bought. I didn't buy it, so. Uh, and uh, the guy at the store where they bought it gave them... Uh, I forget what it's the stuff's called, but it's like, um, it's not styrofoam. It's it's called something else, but it's not wood, and uh, it's like pressed foam that's in the shape of the trim you want, and then it's got like a. a fake um here you can hang out here for now all right uh not fake but it's got like a vinyl finish to it and um okay let me guess my hardened clay is back over here where i emptied out my chest and so um when you cut it you have to you have to be really careful with it otherwise it uh it splinters because it's it's not wood and uh you know it just uh your saw will tear the basically glued on picture <laughs> that makes it look like wood uh, anyways, it's terrible stuff, and he gave him nails to put up with. It's supposed to go up with glue. And I'm like, are you sure? And they're like, oh no, that's what the guy said to use. And I'm like, alright. And so, uh, I caught my, my niece the other day. She's like one and a half. And she was over there, picking away at it. Uh, just pulling... Pulling the little bits off. I'm like, stop. Um, and then there's apparently like corner pieces you can put on it uh, where it gets to the edge. And uh, they didn't get any of those. Oh, you can only get eight out of that. Dang it. What was I thinking? Eight is not going to be enough. I am going to have to grow some. Cocoa beans. <laughs> um, but, uh, anyway, so, you know, I put that up and then they couldn't, I don't know, whatever. They can't work a tape measure, they can't work a string or an ink pen or anything like that. So, uh, they can paint and that's about it. Uh, they can barely strip with all their big grand plans. And uh, and then when they they don't get their way, they pout. They're adults. Well, nobody would fix this, so I guess we're just going to have to stay this way. Well, why don't you fix it? 
Just you do it. You want to change? You change it. Okay. Hmm. I think we're going to do that with it right there. And then I'm going to have to get some more uh, cocoa beans. And then we'll fill this in. And that will be the pattern on my floor. I wonder if I shouldn't do some of that over here, too. And then we can do one like... Like that. Or... Eh, maybe not. I don't think I want this one in the middle here. Uh, but yeah, so... <laughs> uh... I don't know. We got a... Uh, they bought a new stove and a new refrigerator. They haven't been delivered yet, but... Um, <laughs> and so because they're getting a new stove and a new refrigerator, they want... They want a new... linoleum. And... Um, um, I admit the kitchen probably needs some more new... Kitchen needs some new linoleum. But, uh... <laughs> Um, they, uh, they want to get new countertops to go with the linoleum. They want the new countertops to look like the linoleum. At least I hope they want new countertops and they just aren't thinking they can put linoleum on the countertop, because that would just be wrong. Uh, but while I'm at the dinner table today, they're like, you could put down linoleum, right? I'm like, what? Uh, how hard is it to put down linoleum? I'm like, I don't know, you gotta, like, move everything, and I guess glue it to the floor, I don't know, I've never put down linoleum. I'm sure you can figure it out. We're gonna get new linoleum for the laundry room, and you need to put it down. I'm like, why do I need to put it down? Uh, what else was I gonna grab? Stone... Not stone brick. Andesite. Stone. I thought I'd grab some stuff and work on the the wall out here. Uh, andesite, andesite, andesite. With that in the middle. Okay. So I need to get some more andesite, 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 andesite. Bam. What did I do over here? Yeah, that's what I thought. There we go. And so, um... Yeah, they... I don't know. It drives me crazy. I guess I didn't need any stone down here. I need andesite. Uh... Nobody nobody wants to or has time. The door thing. Alright, this will be the last thing. The door thing uh, drives me crazy because a lot of what happened was people not using the door correctly and then not fixing it correctly and then using tools to close it incorrectly and then wondering why it won't close anymore. And Or once you get it closed, then they immediately have to use it. Like, nobody's used the door in three months... And then this weekend, they decided they had to try to open the door because... I don't know. Uh, I watched them walk up to the door, grab the handle, and pull on it, and then realize, hey, this door's tape on it. Why is there tape on the door? There's been tape on the door all winter because the door won't close. And then once I did get it to close, it had a draft, and I couldn't get the draft to stop. 
and I probably spent four hours getting the door to close so we didn't freeze to death this winter. And you knew that already. Uh, oh, well, it's not closed now. I'm like, well, I don't care at this point. And uh, that's why the door blew open, because someone apparently tried to open it again and then didn't close it. And so all that was holding it closed was tape. And the tape gave way today. Uh, Alright, I can make andesite from diorite and gravel, I th think. No. No. Diorite and... Cobble? I know diorite is the root. Diorite and cobble? Yes, okay. Diorite and cobble. And then that gives me andesite. And then that gives me some polished andesite. But, uh, yeah, so the, they want to get the door replaced. Well, we need to get the door replaced. And so they're looking at me at dinner going, you can put in a new door, right? I'm like, no, I can't. And uh, they're like, well, how are we supposed to get a door put in then? I don't know. You hire someone? Do you have the place where you buy the door and install the door? I'm like, I don't, I don't have the tools here, probably. Because uh, guess what? I'm not a door installer. <laughs> I don't work at a lumber yard. Gasp. Uh, I may not have the tools to build a house. Just saying. Uh, you know, you know what my job is. I do training for people to get certified in computer things. I repair computers. I don't build houses. I don't know what you want. And... Then they look at me like I'm crazy that they should have to get someone to install. That's kind of... I guess I... I did, uh... I did make sure this was all even, but... Yeah, I'm liking the way this is looking. All other than the fact I've got to wait for my cocoa beans to grow here but uh, let's uh let's shift modes so we can get a little better look at this look at that whoop I like that I think that looks pretty nice in here uh, I also think that uh, that's weird <laughs> Uh, it's some kind of lighting thing, I guess, making me realize it's dark, but when I hit F1 to close my UI, it goes away. Um, I think with the slabs, we can actually put lighting under the floor to get rid of those dark spots, too. So, uh, game mode zero. And, of course, I don't have any... Uh, lighting methods on me and I probably put it in that chest way over there but uh, yeah uh, I did dang it yeah I spent all that time uh, getting redstone today and I had 43 blocks already in here that was crazy uh, now the cocoa bean stuff I wasn't expecting to use so much brown um, but it grows pretty fast in fact that one there I think is, whoops, ready to harvest again. Yeah, see, we got three cocoa beans out of that. And I shall go ahead and put two of those down. Uh, I used to have cocoa beans growing back at my uh, little farmhouse there, but thanks to my inability to open the correct f version of Minecraft... Alright, so we need two more pieces, 
and then this will be done. Uh, now the sides here, one of these is going to go out to the old castle, which is just going to be a stone tower right here. Uh, and then one of these goes to the ballroom, one of these goes to the uh, dining room, and one of these goes to the guest rooms, and then um, upstairs will go to uh, like a balcony on this side. Um, this will probably tap into the uh, old castle, and this will lead into uh, the family apartments, and then the manor house will be done. Uh, of course, that's like, what, multiple weeks of work yet? Uh, but then I think my town will be done, so uh, we will move on to another project. I don't know if I'll ever finish that ship that's out there, but uh, I do have plans for my next project already. Uh, so I'm kind of... Kind of chomping to the bit a little bit to go get started on that, because it's going to be... I'm like, what is that? That's... It's a light block with a lever underneath of it in preparation for the next thing I do. Um, with the wall, not my next project. Um, I'm actually going to go to a new area to do the next project. Anyways, uh, I'm going to call it here, so click like if you like, subscribe to be sure and catch the next one, and I will talk to you later.